गुड मॉर्निंग लास्ट क्लास वी वर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट मेल मर्ज बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द मेल मर्ज आई हैव स्टार्टेड शोइंग हाउ टू क्रिएट अ सी वी सो आफ्टर वी क्रिएटेड द सी वी नाउ आई शोड यू हाउ टू इंसर्ट अ फोटोग्राफ हाउ टू पुट द एड्रेस हाउ टू पुट हेडिंग्स हाउ टू अंडरलाइन हाउ टू पुट बुलेट्स ऑल दिस थिंग्स आई हैव इम्प्लीमेंटेड बाई CV while creating a new CV. Now this CV, I want to mail to a few companies. Now for that I need a couple of uh, addresses. So to have that address, I will first create a list. That list I am going to create in Excel first. So let's open Excel. I am using earlier I have told you I am using Office 2007. So <coughs> my excel 2007 let me open here i am going to create a list let it first get opened okay now this is my excel sheet you'll be learning excel parallelly so here i am going to type the details of companies that means company name manager name address phone number email id all these things so i am putting all some fictitious names now let me first increase the width company name company address just increasing the width of the columns manager name manager name phone number email now these are my headings under which i am going to place my data so let's first start this i'll just put three such data and then i'll show you how to use the list inside the mail merger bold let me make it center so i've done it centered now company name J P T Projects Limited. I'm just giving roughly some name. Thirty one. Manik Tala Road. Manager name, Mister. M Joshi. Now I'm going to put some phone number. All these are arbitrary numbers and data which I'm feeding in just to show you how these work. Email. M Joshi two one. the read gmail dot com. This is the first address I'm writing. Next company name. Uh, suppose Surekha Company Limited. Forty two, forty two, N S C Bus Road, N S C Bus Road. Okay, pin code I have missed out. Let me put some pin code. I'll go to insert, insert sheet column. So 
here let me put pin code pin code manikthala Seven zero 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 four two seven zero 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 eight six. Now these are not being centered. Let me make this also centered. Okay, later on I'll do it. Mrs. C. Paul. Zero zero three zero four five. Now, one more data, let me put it. So three data. I'm trying to figure it out. Sixty-eight Bali guns place. Pin code seven zero 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 three two. Mister. So I have finished placing all the email and etc. Now this data I want to make it center. Same way in Word how you do here also. I'll just put center alignment and keep it. Now I just want to make it a uh, bit oriented so it looks more structured. I will just give a border sign. Let me see where is border now. Here is the border, all sides border. So I put it here like this. So this is my address list. Now make sure I need to save this. So I will just go to save as Excel 97-2003 workbook because it's a compatible version. So I will use this. You can also choose Excel workbook. I will use address underscore mail march. This is the name now where will i place it i have a folder called become semester 3 or something like this i have a folder name so let me go and click there here i'm going to place address underscore mail mode. so i have clicked and saved this so if i want i can close it or i can minimize it also now here now my cv is ready my address list is ready now i have to write a main document and then i have to write the or start the mail merge so how should i go about it now the first step is i have to use the mailing tab i have to go to mailing tab here last class i was showing you from wizard but this all these options are given here i will choose one by one and then i am going to show it to you how it will work the first option is start mail merge so what is it it is a letter so i am going to choose the option letter 
next step now this portion again i'm repeating mailings start mail merge letters so now we have a letter ready letter option we we'll go now next option second portion select recipients whom are i am going to use now we have three options here one is type new list second is use existing list and third is select from outlook contacts now right now i have no outlook contacts i don't want to type a new list because i have already created a list so i am going to use use existing list where my data is my data is in sheet 1 so it is showing sheet 1 dollar so i click this okay now do i want to edit anything i do not want to edit anything so i will start now writing the letter now this was my initial document i have to write my main document so i in the first page covering letter actually doesn't stay anything so i will use my main document here so i am writing my address let me copy my address from here This entire thing is getting added. So, this is a small, small hindrance which we might face that will come across while working. So, you have to manage with it. So that photo is getting selected. So, I am not doing copy paste. So, let me place the cursor. I am pressing space bar. Thirty-two by one. If Goria Hat Road South. Now, why this is coming? Because these are bold and underlined is already clicked. That is why. So let's go to Home and deselect it. Bold also let me. Okay, bold I can keep it for the address part. Doesn't matter. So here, let me reduce the space that is fits in one line. Let me make this Goria Hat Road South. Flat five F. Suppose if I write anything of my address, Kolkata thirty three. obviously i should give a date whenever i am writing a letter i should give a date that is very important today is 21 you will give the current date of your choice now letter begins with two the or two instead of the i will use go to mailings insert merge field what these are my details inside my address list of that file two what will i do two manager name two manager name the first field it has come oh automatically it is taking the first one of company name i should give a this is directly of your mail merge it is coming here pin code
now my address part is over